Hi, welcome, 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 welcome. All right, let's do uh, I'm on my fifth. Let's do Taurus. Let's do Taurus. My little Tavarians. My little Tavarians. Okay. Raw well, love now until September 9th. Okay. I hope you guys have a fantastic next two weeks. I hope you guys are enjoying the moon energy. Okay. Um, I have uh, Kai sitting behind me. He's just kind of chilling. I don't know. I'm not feeling anything. Um, I think we're good. I think I'm, I'm going to definitely try to read intuitively and give channeled messages. Okay. As I go. Um, and that's it. What's going on with my Tauruses? What's going on with my Tauridians? My Tauridians? My Tauridians? We got a Knight of Cups reverse. We're not wanting to talk about something with somebody. Okay, not wanting to put emotion into anything. Okay, wanting to come out of conflict. Um, but not wanting to talk. You don't want to talk to somebody, I should say. Um, I think you're no longer thinking about conflict. You're no longer thinking about somebody in particular. You're no longer thinking about whether or not you're going to get a message, what direction you're going to go in. You're just kind of carefree right now. I kind of feel bubbly. I kind of feel like um, I want to do it with the wicked. I'm telling you, like, you're on a mission. Not like a mission, but a mission. All right? Like a... And it's not a spiritual mission right now. It's like a... Just content. But you don't feel the need to deliver a message or to talk to somebody. That is for damn sure. But being totally okay with it at the same time. Okay? Yeah, ten of cups. See, you're seeking your own fulfillment. You're like, I'm out. Like, I don't know whether or not you're, you're out. Three of one. I'm like, I don't know whether or not you're out. You're out. All right. You're about to to bring some stuff into fruition. Okay. Um, but I think it's because you are intent. I think you're very content on where you're at, regardless of the scenario that may be presented to you or has been presented to you. You're kind of like. Do, 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 do. I'm on my own. Do, 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 do. You know? Queen of Wands reverse, though. Tell me about the Queen of Wands. I don't feel you reversed. I'm not feeling it like that. So if you are, the devil reversed. So it, it's... You're not putting action into something. All right? Something that was toxic. You're coming out of it. Maybe it's because I was just talking about it. It just is confirming that for you. Um, because it's either that or you're not dealing, you're not putting no effort into a cap. Okay. Um, I don't even think like you're in beast mode anymore. It's like, you're not. I think before you were in beast mode. You better go with the flow. You really are. Tell me about this three of wands. Because this is something in your life that made you happy. This is something that you're looking forward to, conjuring up. You're writing in it. A, a book, a journal, maybe you're keeping a dream journal, maybe you're doing spells. Yeah, see another three of pens. Yeah, see, you're coming up, you're conjuring up something. Good for you guys. You're very content right now. Makes the fellas go. I love it. Look at the Wheel of Fortune. Yeah, yeah, you're content.
So you have three different piles, okay? Somebody's not talking to you. You're not telling somebody how you feel. You're not in conflict with them anymore. Like, I think before it was kind of like you were so determined to do something, but you're like, I don't even, nope, I'm done. Like, beast mode done. Like, I'm beasting in a different direction, okay? You're not putting action into anything that was toxic. Like, you're out of the toxicity right now. Right now, it's all about you. It's all about your coins, your adventure, your journey, all right? Your happiness, all right? And I'm telling you, when I said you were content, you got the Wheel of Fortune. Like, here comes your change. Here, here it is, okay? Like, this is beautiful. It truly, truly is beautiful. It's a great read. Any other messages? Five of Swords reverse. So yeah, you're not you're not dealing with anything. Um, I will tell you your swords in the air though. Even with this being rever reversed, the swords are up. Okay, so you're not taking no bullshit from nobody. But and it's looking right up at that big pile up there. Okay, so you're just not. All right. So we have the death card. So letting letting something go. All right. To have a brand new start. It's so, I'm going to tell you, this This is how I like it, but the fool and the death have been coming out side by side in all my weekly reads, okay? You're, you're tired, but you're going with the flow. Like, you're good, all right? Time's up when it comes to something. You're like, I'm done. You're not giving no more time, all right? I don't think you're being a bitch, but with your swords being up, you're definitely not taking no bullshit from nobody. That is for damn sure, all right? Something's about to go in your direction. Tell me about the Wheel of Fortune. And this could be like, oh, careful you don't repeat the same thing. Nah. All right. Um, this is something going in your direction within the next two weeks. There's no question there. All right. Yeah, seven of wands. So this is, you're just going. All right. It's, you're not guided. Uh, some of you may be guided, but to me, this is not you're being guided. This is working hard to succeed. Okay. Because... The eight of wands is next and what's up here, but it's, it goes eight and that talks about a spiritual journey. Like you're on your way. Okay. You might be a little guarded. Tell me about the seven of wands. Best advice for the seven of wands, seven of wands, seven of wands, but it's looking right up. So it could just be guarded. Okay. The emperor reverse. So I think you're guarded when it comes to this emperor, whatever the situation is up here, because it's going in this direction. All right, something's going in that direction, and you don't want to put effort into it. Um, I don't think you're trying to control it at all. Tell me about this, Emperor. You're just kind of like, get out of it. I know for a fact you are, okay? But you're going to have a new start with the world reversed. Yeah, motherfucker. Sorry. This person's coming back around. Something's coming back around. The wheel's here. It's up to you whether or not you're going to repeat karma. I don't think you're going to. I really don't. But the universe is going to give you an opportunity to repeat it. <laughs> They're like, oh, you want to F up again? Or you want to try this again? Not necessarily F up. You know, you can make stuff work. But um, I just, I don't think you want to. That's all. I just, I don't feel like you want to. That's it. It's just how I feel. Like, to me, you're not putting action into it. And somebody's pissed off whoever's coming back around. They're a little guided, too. But you're supposed to be guided. In this situation, you're supposed to be guided. They want, they're they giving you the ability. I'm going to tell you right now, the universe gave you the ability to be guarded against this person right now because you're supposed to be. Okay? And I'm right. So, bottom of the deck was the hangman with the empress. All right. So, you're not hung up yet, but don't get hung up with the four of pence in the middle reverse. So, you're slowly letting go. See, that's what I'm saying. Like, you're letting go. Like, that's why I'm saying I got the goosebumps. You're going with the flow right now. Like, you're, you're beasting it in a different direction. All right. Let me pull from a different deck. Pull in from a different deck for you guys. Good damn. 
dance. We'll dance. Look at the uh, lighter side of life. Look at it. Don't, don't take things so seriously right now. Um, keep seeking that happy. Keep going straight to it. Okay? Taurus, Taurus. Where is he? Peekaboo. 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 Taurus. 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 That's too many. Um, but I'm feeling them. All right, something about understanding a situation. I think what you, I think what it is you understand is that what you were dealing with was something that was very karmic, and and you were tired fighting, and you were tired um, about being in like a frenzy. This was you being in beast mode. I think what it's trying to tell me right here with all these cards like this, a. You're understanding that something was karmic. You're understanding, chances are, you definitely had a past life with this person. Um, but you're, like, fighting? I don't I don't want to fight anymore. Like, I don't want to battle. Like, I don't want beast mode like that, all right? Because you were living, you weren't living in the moment like that. You know, this is moment to moment. So it's kind of like, so for instance, what this card means is, like, you were just going with the flow like, but not going with the flow like that. It's like almost like, um, let me give you an example. Um, so wrapped up in whatever it was that you didn't even give a shit where your money was coming in for you to pay bills or something like that. Like you weren't in the moment like that. You know what I mean? Like you weren't thinking about your future. You were, you, it was just, you were, something consumed you so much where it was like, it was a battle. Okay. Um, but you overcame that battle. All right. So that's beautiful. Um, let me pull from another deck. Say hi to everybody, Kai. Say hi to everybody, Kai. Say hi to everybody. No, Taurus, Taurus. So you have the six of wands um, with um, the eight of shells. So you're on a new a quest, all right, and which is the eight of cups. But to me, this is saying you can be very successful walking away from whatever this is. Um, something either is going to be presented to you, and you don't you're not going to know what direction to go in. Um, Because you've already walked away from something. So if if it's coming back up, because to me, you're walking right towards you're happy. There is no question. You're like, you're renewed. You're feeling good. You're feeling fresh. You, you're going. You're feeling triumphant, okay? Um, so keep keep going. But to me, this is saying something you, in the next two weeks is going to come back into your life. It could be whatever this person, place, or thing was that's going to come back into your life. Um, and it's the king of shells. And they're going to... This is somebody... You're going to have to choose whether or not you walk away from them again or if they walked away from you. I don't know who. You got a, you got a big decision to make because this person's going to block your path. This person coming back around is going to try to block your path. And I'm not saying like in a bad way, but they're going to halt. They're going to bring you to a halt. Somebody stepped in. I think somebody new stepped in, to be honest with you. I think this is somebody new, or it could be a past. Tell me about this King of Shells. To me, I think it's it's you might have both scenarios happening right now for you, because um, I'm feeling it. Because um, you're not, yeah. See the Knight of Acorns. I told you in a different direction. You have two, you have two things coming at you. You have a new opportunity, and you have an opportunity from the past, um, and. If the past comes back, they might block the new opportunity. You little biatcher bastard. <clears throat> Bye.
best of luck. Best of luck there. Somebody's going to try your past six of shells. Your past going to come in and block your new opportunity. I don't know what you're going to do. I just got the goosebumps. I know I, I'm laughing like it's kind of funny, but like you're, you're beasting it in another direction. So don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. Don't let somebody else steal your thunder. All right? Just go with it. I'm telling you. They're going to come in and block you from going in that direction. Because you're going in this direction. Sorry. It's opposite when it's up here. But when it's down here, it's, it's going in this way. You know what I mean? Like, you're going to be very triumphant walking away, going on your new quest. Like, you're a brand new person. You went through a renewal. Okay? Um, but your past is going to come back into the picture. But I have a feeling with this scenario, you've met somebody new. Or you're about to. And, yeah, with the Six of Cups right there with the Two of Crystals reversed. And it's like, you don't even want to, like, uh, make the decision because you've already conjured up, like, the courage to, to move forward. And, and you already reevaluated your life. This is what I'm saying. Like, I think this person thinks they can come in and charm you, too. And you're, you're freaking outy. Like, yeah, I'm not kidding you. I don't think you're going to accept the past back. I think you're going to go with brand new. All right. So there's that. There's that. Let's pull you some lessons. And then we'll pull you an oracle. <clears throat> and then I need to make a sandwich or something. I'm hungry. I'm getting hungry. Oh, I just saw that love card. That's... That can contradict my whole entire damn read. Let's see what we got for my lessons for love. <sighs> Being open to seeing both sides of the situation. So your lesson right now is to look at both sides of a situation, which... That's too many. You did pull in the other deck understanding that you have a past life with somebody. Whoever this past is, okay? The universe is asking you to look at both sides of the situation. Um, and then we have judgment, okay? I understand that everyone has their unique paths and challenges, so they want you to understand the scenario. So, whoa. I got the goosebumps. So, like, whoa. Like, whoa. You know, it's funny, when I was out at my bachelorette party Saturday night, um, I walked out I walked out to smoke my little fake cigarette, and this guy, gentleman, was staring at me, and he's like, wow. I was like, okay. And I was like, don't don't be shy or nothing. We were shooting the shit. You know, I'm a people person. I was laughing, introducing myself and whatnot. And um, my other girlfriends walked outside, and there was three of them, so we're all sitting there. And he's like, wow, wow, as they like walk into the door. It was kind of funny. He was shit-faced. Um, but he was funny. He was polite. You know what I mean? Very straightforward. Um, and then I was, we were dying laughing because I was like, nah, you can stop with the wows. I'm like, you, why don't you just say whoa? <laughs> you know, because there's four of us now. So like, whoa, like, whoa. So that's what I'm saying. Like, I can feel you guys' energy like, whoa. Like, you, you're good. You know what I mean? But... Something's going to try to stop your path, which is would make sense, okay? Definitely makes sense to me. So hang in there. Hang in there. All right. I realize that it's fear. I realize that I'm testing to, be, to resolve to live in the energy of love. So you're still fearing something. And that has to do with that love card I saw. For, so for some, you truly love the past, but you're pretending you don't. I'm not going to lie to you. Some of you are really doing that to yourselves. So, and some are not, okay? But some are. Or you're just afraid to move forward with this new one because of something that happened in the past. So you have to take that how that resonates with you, okay? I wish you the very best of luck. Let's pull you an oracle. And get the best advice to me for the next two weeks for my little Tauruses, for my little Tavidians. What does it want to tell me? Stay invincible right now. 
when it comes to your visions or you're either blocking your visions and you're staying invincible, but you have the inner knowing. I'm telling you, it's you got something there. Something. You 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 have the old coming back at you and you got new too, so best of luck. All right, that's too many, but it talks about bless you. That's the beginnings, you know, so you choose. That's basically telling me you're exactly where you need to be and you're going to have to figure it out, okay? Um, and here we go, the honesty card. So to me, like I said, some of you are lying to yourselves. Um, but this also talks about, you know, the past could be lying too because it's, it's time for you to figure that out though, okay? My darling, you have chosen the symbol for clarity and true communication. Now is the time to be absolutely honest with yourself about what it is or what direction you're going in or what you're thinking about. If your motives are real and your feelings are too, honesty is the best way to truly step into your power. When you choose honesty above all else, my goddess, I will send you the courage to do what's right. And you have the fear card, okay? This is also a time to demand honesty and integrity from others. You have the right to get clear messages. There is the greatest freedom and power of telling the truth. So if you really don't want to be with this past, then don't. You know, you want to move forward with somebody new, but you're holding something from the new, don't. Tell the truth, okay? Um, in order for you to have the most fulfillment and the greatest feeling of power and freedom right now is to be honest with yourself, okay? So if you got a lot of love for this past, and say you got a lot of love for this past and be honest with the past, whether there's a chance you can lose the, the new, in the past, it doesn't matter. It's, it's the karma coming back around for you to be faced with, okay? Um, for you in order to make that decision. And for others, I'm telling you, you don't want it back, but the person's going to come back around and block it anyway. And you're going to have to figure out whether or not you're going to beast mode right past them, like blow the door right down, or like stomp the door, you know, like not even stomp. What do the horses do? They, um, I got a damn horse. I can't even think about buck, you know, like kick the door in. You know, like, that's what I'm saying. Like, you got some decisions here, and I wish you the best of luck. Um, by looking at this card, I'm going to tell you maybe you should light some candles, okay? Um, by the time this new moon rolls around, you're going to know. You're going to be in your new direction. You're going to be sitting in honesty. You're going to be okay with your decision. Um, maybe light some candles. Maybe it will help you. Certain scents, aromas. Okay. Um, or you're going to hear the truth. To me, it's it's being honest with yourself and with others. Oh, Kai is really looking at you guys, huh? You're really looking at everybody, Papa. Can you say hi? Can you say hi, Kai? Uh, say hi to everybody. Say hi, Kai. So, I wish you the best of luck. I love you guys.